With this trick, even the toughest meat becomes tender in just a few minutes. Start by cutting 600 grams of thick beef steaks. Cut them in half, just like this. Next, sprinkle baking powder over each steak. Flip them and repeat this process on the other side. Now, transfer all these steaks to a medium bowl. Add the juice of one orange, just like this, and let them rest for 10 minutes. After this time has passed, transfer them back to the cutting board. Add five crushed garlic cloves, spreading them all over the steaks, one pinch of salt, one pinch of black pepper, one pinch of nutmeg, Flip them and repeat the same seasoning on the other side. Take this time to share this video and write in the comment section the name of the city from which you're watching it and we'll make sure to leave a heart especially for you. Oh, and thanks for sharing this video. Once you've done that, in a large skillet over medium to low heat, add one drizzle of olive oil. And once this oil is hot enough, add the steaks and fry them until golden brown on both sides. Have you got that recipe app? It's already available for download. With this app, you'll have access to all our recipes in the palm of your hands, and you'll get notified every time we upload a new recipe. In addition to all that, you'll also have access to an exclusive area in which you can bookmark your favorite recipes. Go to the App Store or Play Store now, type that recipe and download it. This is the right point. In the same skillet, add one medium onion chopped into small cubes, four crushed garlic cloves, and stir them until slightly golden brown. When that happens, add the steaks we prepared earlier. 300 milliliters of vegetable broth, one pinch of chili flakes, two bay leaves, stir everything very well. Cover the skillet and simmer for 10 minutes, always flipping the steaks to make sure both sides are nicely cooked. I hope you're enjoying the recipe. Share it with your friends. By doing so, you'll be helping us go even further. This is the right point. That recipe is ready. You may now serve and enjoy it. I hope you like this recipe. Now, I'll head to the comment section and leave a heart to everyone who left the name of their city. See you next recipe. Bye-bye.